A rookie. Hello. Liking immortality? Not getting to your head? Oh, my manners. I'm Flavius. I'm trying to advance science here while others are waving their swords. Of course I'm serious. Aside from me, no one's even trying to understand how things work in this world. Oh, right. This is my holographic form. No time to flit about. And there's so many immortals nowadays. Just so much to do. Right, back to business. Well, what are we waiting for? That transport capsule? You're getting in. I'll join you in the training hall. The hall's completely virtual. I've been doing all of our training here, ever since my lab was nearly destroyed. First, you'll need to pick a class. I'll show you how. Pick an available class, and you'll learn its basic abilities. How about that for a miracle of science? Of course. You can always change your class, at any time. In a tricky situation, you have the Argus system to offer you advice. And of course, I invented it. Binder attacks from a distance, inflicts less damage than the Cryomancer, but has a higher survivability. This basic support class is important in any group. Their powers are aimed at protecting their teammates. The Cryomancer can cause significant damage from a distance. However, they do not last long in close combat, so they try to avoid it. Their role in a group is to inflict damage. Even new players will have no difficulty playing this class. The Paladin is a melee fighter. Average damage, but high survivability. In a group, they draw the enemy's attention to themselves. They are a simple defense class. They take longer than the Cryomancer to kill an enemy, but die less often. The Cryomancer can cause... What you see now is a pack. These enemies are weak on their own, but a group of them can be extremely dangerous. Eliminate them using an area of effectability. Enemies that are strong, but few in number, should be killed one by one. Use abilities that inflict significant damage to a single target. Sometimes you can avoid damage. Take a closer look at the enemy. Some attacks take time to execute. You can evade them. Strike, send it out with a bang. Must have broken. 
Don't panic and try to hang on until I fix everything. Did you like it? I don't normally hand out the Divine Form. It's not even in this training course, but... That was an emergency. Someday, you'll be able to use it without my assistance. In the real world. And not just a virtual space. Oh, it's nothing. Do your best. And the desired results will follow suit. There are many troubles on Aelion, and the most crucial one is invasions. Go fight. Go save lives. Go make friends and gain more followers, and you will eventually become strong enough to take the next step and become a junior god. I am beginning to sound like Harita. That's it for now. You can return to the Divine Observatory or wherever you need to go. You can stay if you like, but I can't promise any more fun. Excellent choice. Each combat school is more than just a set of skills. It is a special path, a philosophy. It is time for you to learn about the mission of Aelion's gods. Come closer to the model of the planet. Listen. Do you hear that? Millions of voices are calling to us for help, begging us to save them. Here, in the observatory, their prayers reach our ears. We are gods, but not almighty. But it is in our power to save lives, eliminate threats, and offer hope. Go. Aelion is waiting for you. Wow, that was quick. They don't waste time in Aelinar. Let me bring you up to speed. The Verds built a lair here, and not just the Verds. I spotted at least a dozen Carrions, too. It looks like they attacked the neighboring towns from here. I wouldn't be surprised if there are also Reapers or... Ravagers with their pets. We need to clean up the area. Your main objective is to move deeper into the island and eliminate the Carrion leader. Without a commander, they will scamper back to their burrows. We'll deal with the rest as we go. Probably the tourists that went missing last week. We'll have to tell their families.
They must be the backbone of the attack force. Show them no mercy. They have no concept of it anyway. Finally here. We were about to make a run for it. We had a very strange failure in the night. The machinery came to life on its own and started churning out combat mechanoids. Those things seized control of the factory and there's no way for us to stop production. We've got to get to the main computer so that we can turn off the conveyor. I'll repeat the question. Why haven't you checked the system?
to leave now. You must remain and make sure everything goes as planned. You can hold your own against a couple of immortals. And that will suffice. Be glad. It is an honorable death. Is that all you can do? Victory data to Divine Observatory.